Hi guys, it's Chanel and t today is a, sp a special day. Today is my mom's birthday, so I'm going to be cooking a, a special dinner. Um, I've already started, so I'm going to just jump, jump you guys in. I have a whole chicken cut, cut up and already seasoned. I have some sweet red peppers, um, onions, and some yellow peppers, and some orange peppers. Um, so it's seasoned and it's ready to go in the oven. I have my oven set at 350, so I'm gonna go, go ahead and pop that in the oven. And then I'm going to um, d dice some potatoes. So when I come back, I'm gonna sh show you what that looks like. I'm gonna make smothered potatoes and probably some fried corn. So once I get that prepared, I I'll jump you guys back in and ca catch you back up. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, so I'm back. As you can see, the, the potatoes are cut. They're in the pot. Um, I've already put the water in. As you can see, I filled up the, the, the water um, almost to, to the, the almost to the top of the pot. Next, I'm, I'm, I'm going to add the, 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 the chopped up onion. I, I chop up my onion very small bit because... You, you you don't want to actually bite bite into the onion. You're adding the onion in there for for, for flavor. Okay, so 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 then you, you want to give that a, a really good stir. Okay. So so after after you done that, you're gonna take one 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 whole whole stick because. This is about maybe three, three pounds of potatoes, depending on um, how big your, your family is. I make enough so, so that they can take take for for, for their, their their lunch, so that they can eat for um, the, the, the dinner and lunch. So I've made quite quite a bit. So. You're going to actually take one, one whole stick of, of I use b b butter. You can use butter, margarine, what, what have you, but I'm going to take one one whole whole stick of butter, and I'm going to sub submerge it right in the middle. I'm just going to push it right right down in there and kind of bit bury it. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to, to, to take my Spanish paprika and I I, I kind of just I, I eyeball. It, it looks like a lot now, but once you get to, to, to cooking, it, it's going to all kind, kind of blend in. I only use just a, a, a tinge of, of pepper because you don't want it to, to, to be spicy, but you, you, you're using it for, for flavor. And I'm going to take just, just a sprinkle of seasoning salt. Okay. And just a little, just a little bit. of granulated garlic. And then I want to give it a good stir. And you can see, see the, the, the water is turning red. Don't worry, your, your, your potatoes won't, won't, won't be red. And, and they won't be, be spicy. I've been making this for, for, for many years. And it is a, a d d delicious d d dish. You, you want to do most of your stirring now b b because once you put it on the eye and the potatoes get soft, start to get soft, you don't want to do all the stirring because you're going to break the potatoes up and then they become, become, become mushy and, and you don't want that. You want them to, to, to stay ch ch chunky. So that's why I'm doing most of my stirring now with my seasonings. And 
and, and like like I said, I, I've been do, doing this for a while, so I can kind of eyeball what, what when I need to to add a, a little bit more of, of some something. But right, right now, everything looks good. So now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a, a lid to it, and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place this on the eye, and I'm going to place it on me, medium high and let it do its thing. Sure. I'll come b back to you once I'm re ready to, to, to prepare the corn. That will be the, the last thing because that, that, that's the, quick, the quickest thing to, to prepare. So I'll come back, back to you once I'm ready to jump you in with the corn. Okay, guys, I'm back. I, I have two teaspoons of um, but butter here melting. I'm about, about to start my corn. I just have a bag of frozen corn from the, the, the local um, grocery store. It's a bag of sweet corn. Um, the potatoes are here. They're they're co they're they're cooking, and then in, in, in the oven here. The, the, the chicken is cooking. So I, I, I do have the, the, the time timer uh, set, set. I'm just going to be adding the sweet whole cut corn, not nothing fancy. Now, actually, I, I like to leave a little butter in there, so I'm going to add my corn that now. With that piece of butter that, that, that was left, I like to inco incorporate that with, with the, the corn. Get, get all the corn kind of kind of mixed into the, the butter a little bit. And the next thing I'm going going to do is I'm going to add a little a little black pepper to, to, to it. Not 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 to, 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 too much. But just a little bit. Now, like I said, this, this is this is going to be fried corn, so I'm going to let this just sit and do its thing in the butter. I'm not going to bother after I mix this pepper in. I'm going to just let it cook and do its own thing. I did add a lid onto the corn just to let it sweat out so, it so that um, it can get the, 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 the moist and, and, and be, begin to, to, to fr fry itself. That, 
that noise you hear, that, that's the, the potatoes getting down with the get, get down. They're, they're boiling away, smothering away. If, if I had smell of vision, uh, the, the smell would just take you away. The aroma smells so good. I already have um, the, the birthday girl's table is already set. We're kind of going with a tropical theme, so it, it's set and ready. So I'll jump you guys back in once I'm ready. All right, so here is the final outcome of my mom's birthday birthday dinners so, so here is the corn that, that's fried corn here is the, the delicious smothered potatoes and next to it is the, the ro roasted Ch chicken with the peppers, onions, and then he he here we have our del delicious fr fruit bowls, and I'll show you the final project once everything is plated. He here's the final uh, fi final outcome: potatoes, corn, chicken. And fruit. Thank you for watching. As always, be good to yourself. Love yourself. Be good to someone else. Until next time, peace and blessings. Bye.